it's not so much a demo of the amp as I wanted to tell us something about uh, something about it jamming a song. Now, one thing is, you hear a song, you should forget everything you know in terms of uh, whatever other people have done to any kind of music. Don't don't play any licks anyone else has played. Uh, there's conventions. Now, things that are conventions are like you've always heard people do this. <laughs> Those are conventions. Nobody owns the rights to those. It's not like you're playing like uh, uh, well, you have to uh, like. It's not like you're playing like the latest thing that somebody came up with. It's usually some variation on something else somebody came up with, and you sound just like them. Don't ever ever play anything that somebody else played. It's not just a, a random convention. And when you do play a convention, play it to the music. Don't don't go well, you know, this is the way so and so that's the way you play it. No, that's not the way you play, that's the way they play it, because that's their character, that's their personality, that's like their soul. And if you can do that, that probably means that you're soulless. And if you can't do it, that probably means you you have your own music. And uh so you might as well because you'll get lost. You'll get lost and you'll never be able to improvise properly because you'll always have been copying people and you won't have a clue. Because all you'll do is hear something and you'll think, well, I can play this to it or I can play that to it. And you'll have these textbook learned or, you know, rote learned. Basically, they're patterns and finger movements. And you don't want to think like that. So you want to think like melody. So when I put this on, and this is just going to be some random backing track that probably I've never played to before. But it's in a genre of music that's, you know... It's all the same, but let's say it's going to be melodic uh, uh, pop rock or melodic ballad rock. Now, when you hear it, I'm going to put it on. You have to, inv you've got to let the music tell you what to do. So, one thing is, if you don't know how to work out melodies just in instinctively on the guitar, because it, it is a harder instrument than, let's say, the piano, where you know left and right, you know these goes notes go higher, these go lower, and you can literally just once you get used to it. Just use the feel, du -du 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 you know. But on a guitar, it's like, well, where are those notes at? Because they're not in a linear fashion, you know. So, so that's an F major.
those look kind of weak because I'm, I'm kind of trying to think. And yeah, I shouldn't actually have to think. You should, you know.
basically you want to you know you hear the song and you want to come up with a melody line so like that one is in the key. <laughs> Just, just remember that that's not where the note goes when you hear that melody in your head again. If you hear it, if you hear anything similar, you'll say, well, that was a good one, you know. But basically, you should learn your intervals and know which intervals go with which. Thank you. 